Yo, what's up? This video has been brought to you by Card Kingdom. Yeehaw, partner. Welcome back to another episode of Single Scoop. This week, we're playing the brand new Splinter Twin, aka the new two card combo. Uh, I've been pretty excited to try it out, especially since I saw it in spoiler season. But we are in a mono black shell, as you could figure out. And we've got a tons of new cards like Karavik the Punisher. Uh, we got Tony Bones, aka Tiny Bones. Uh, but most importantly, I wanted to talk about Insatiable Avarice. This is the spree spell that allows us to tutor and or turn it into a Painful Truths and a Vampiric Tutor. That's obviously great when we have a combo at the core of our deck like Bloodletter of Aklazots, which is if you would lose life or if your opponent would lose life during your turn, they would lose twice that much. Combine that with Rush of Dread, where the other spree spell with the last mode, target opponent loses half their life rounded up. So with that, that half of their life rounded up will mean that Bloodletter plus Rush of Dread is the auto kill. Obviously, Rush of Dread also has the sack outlet, the mass sack, and of course, Makes it so you can pay two more to make your opponent ditch half their hand rounded up. And we're trying a brand new card in Harvester of Mystery. Or Misery. How could I even say that when I know that Misery is always the menu? I'm really hyped on Harvester of Misery. It's something that just can give something minus two, minus two just by discarding it. Uh, if it enters the battlefield, it does an infest effect on all creatures. Uh, but yeah, all around, Mono Black got a lot of sweet new tools, including Karavik. I want to see how it does in this early access event. All right, I'll keep this. I love that my hand was just the Asian MTG, dude. I am representing so hard. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> I don't know why that's that's the handle I got, but I'm glad we got it, you know? I guess we're, we're on to the next one. All right. Go ahead and play. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just get some bodies going. It looks like... We should be back here. My internet disconnected for a split second because I have the coolest. All right, we swung in. We played Graveyard Trespasser. It looks like we're just playing a normal deck, doesn't it? <laughs> I love that. I want to go and find... Hold on. Okay, so this would cost me a total of five mana to do. Or I could go Painful Truths. I either go Painful Truths or I go Insatiable Avarice. I think I'm going to go Insatiable av av uh Actually, I think I want Card Advantage. I'll draw the cards, please and thank you. Yes! We just got Painful Truths online. Well, that's awkward. I didn't even know there was an armadillo in the set. So I am so close. I have half the combo. I have half the combo right now. I'm gonna target them. I'm gonna commit a crime. Ooh, that's a terror. All right, so I guess we'll just do that. Play a body. And now... I'm going to go ahead and... I, my opponents are just going to die before I get to do what I want to do. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Here we go. <laughs> I will show James that I casted one new card. <laughs> All right. We're up against Kibler. All right. Well, I'm going to keep a two-lander and get punished. Let's see what I got here. No! Give me lands! I just want lands! Oh, this is about to get real bad for us, isn't it? Oh, wait. Kibler's on Grixis? Uh, sure. I'll take Terror of the Peaks. Why not? That seems kind of painful to let you keep, but I guess I'm going to have to let you. Let's see if I draw a land. I drew a land. I'm so good at this game. I'm so good at this game. I drew a land. I even have a second land as a backup. In I go. In I go. All right. So good at this game right now. Drew a land, baby. I could send in the damage and see if I get an exile off, right? Cool. All right, sweet, I guess. Or not an exile. I get one of these, which I don't think Kibler would mind. I just need to live long enough to where maybe I can resolve. Do I go Insatiable av Avarice or do I go for... Lily make him sack again? Okay. I think I'm going to make Kibler sack here. Because I'm very worried about whatever Kibler's doing. Am I going to be in pain? I am going to be in pain, In matter as a matter of fact. I'm going to try to block. Does it deal damage to Lily? Doesn't. I'll block. Sure. Let's see if he bounces it back. He does not bounce it back. 
I have less copies of Blood Letter. We eat a card. I just go in for three. Next turn, we play Blood Letter. Can we draw Rush of Dread? Oh, he's got Sarkov. That's so sick. Perfect. I think Kimberly thought I went and got a board wipe or something. What is that? Wait, what? Oh! Oh! Am I dead? Wait, am I dead? Do I die? I play my blood letter. I, pl I play my blood letter. I hang back and I, I get ready here. Grixis Dragons doesn't play answers. That's not very cash money of them. I know that Kibler knows the combo exists. Oh! Am I dead? I'm dead. I'm dead. Wah! <laughs> I gotta try, right? Okay, okay. Can I get rid of every- No, I can't. Oh, I wanted a combo off so bad! I, if I had drawn a land there, I think I would have been okay. Because then there only would have been one Terror of the Peaks. As opposed to two copies there. I wanted a combo off so bad! No, that's Sarkon! We lose! We lose. Because now that's double haste. He gets to get in there and swing twice. GG's! Let's see if my internet holds. Ooh, I love Tony Bones. But I think getting my mana base correct is probably better than playing Tony Bones, right? Oh, I wanted to play turn one Tony Bones so bad. Okay. We'll go ahead and play Deep Cavern Bat. This will probably get answered, but it's fine. Sure. Uh, they're, they're playing the Universal Solvent. There it is. Void Rend. Uh, what does that do? I'm going to go ahead and just play this. I don't, I don't know if there's going to be anything for me to target other than... Yeah, like, I don't, I don't think there's anything for me to target. I'm just going to make him ditch cards. So they get rid of the land. They need black mana, or they actually have it. No, no, Ancient Cornucopia actually has already done that for them, so that's good. Okay. I'm gonna try to mess with their mana base. Now I'm gonna just go ahead and play Tony Bones. Tony Bones coming down means that I get to potentially just get Voidrend and blow up their, uh, blow up anything they play. Wait, does it not work? Whenever Tony deals da combat damage to a player, target non-land car, non-land permanent. Oh, they don't have any permanents. That's the problem. Okay. Well, I'm gonna just go ahead and play Tony Bones and kill off Tony Bones. They don't have anything that I can... I, I, I forgot, it's only non-land permanent. That's kind of brutal. Oh, man. I wanted to... I was like, why didn't they kill my Tony Bones? Because they read my card. Oh. And now I've got all of these, though. All right, I've got Karavik, which does nothing. Sure. Do they have creatures? Like, I'm starting to think they may not have creatures for me to start, like, do, commit a crime with. And I would really like to draw my cards that do something here. I'm gonna cast my bat. Uh, decline here. Go ahead and just exile Doppelgang, make them spend their mana to bring it back. Uh, I do not have that much stuff to do, unfortunately, otherwise. I don't have my combo anywhere. Next turn, they'll be able to make a copy of almost everything here. So Graveyard Trespasser is going to be huge, right? If I get to keep my stuff... Oh wait, they actually have a creature? Uh, sure. Let's play Lily. They actually had the counter spell. That's brutal. Ouch. No more 
Uh, submit zero. Just gotta start exiling their spells as much as I can. I don't know how that got plotted. Exile that instead of putting your graveyard, it resolves you do put it because- So they have a plotted counter spell, right? Am I reading that correctly? That is a plotted counter spell, right? So that means they could... It's it's sorcery speed? How does it work, actually? It doesn't do anything. I could be nice, though. I could cast into it. That's very cool. Whoa, hey! You got two of those? Nuts! That's actually nuts! What does this read? Uh, if you do create a treasure, if you pay all the colors you need. Let me see something here. I casted, right? So I don't got to worry about too much. I can exile the legendary out of the yard. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to activate Lily here because I do want to get the uh, the minus out of her. I don't know what I'm going to do, though, when they eventually just cast whatever off these five cards. Because they have a bunch of hideaway spells. But they need multicolor cards, right? I think I'm willing to trade my Kervik. Kervik has kind of popped off as well, by the way. Kervik's definitely done some work here. Can I draw my combo? That's all I need. I just need to know, if, can I draw my combo? Do I want to even play Graveyard Trespasser? Yeah, why not? It's free value. Sure. I'm so close. Where's my Rush of Dread? I just need a Rush of Dread. This opponent keeps gaining life. All right, so we're just going to quad up. Let's go. Let's go. I don't have anything left to get in my yard, but I'll get rid of this doppelgang. Nope. Submit zero. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh my God, I'll keep it. I'll keep it. I'll keep it. I have magic cards. I have magic cards I can play with. I have three lands. Let's see if I draw past three lands. Uh, interaction's good. Interaction's very good. Well, if they play one threat, I can play Lily and eat that up. Oh, no, it's Skellies. Let's make you sacrifice that. Are skeletons the thing? Oh, my God. They had Kakazan. That is so good here. Wow. Actually clutch. All right, let's see what your deck is all about. All right, I got the combo. I got the combo. I need one land. I need one land. That's all. Just give me one land. Okay. Okay. That is a very big Vodmir. I need to see what's in your hand. You can kill this. That's fine. I just need to see what's in your hand. You got it. Okay. Kill Vodmir. Play with fire. Skeleton thing. Okay. Okay. All right, 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 all right. So this turn, they're going to play creatures, skeleton creatures you control have haste. Uh, so I'm going to take a lot of damage, right? Enters the battlefield, create a 2-2. Two, two. So that's three, five, seven. Seven again. Can I... I don't know if I can take another seven, right? Will I even draw another land? Let's find out. I think I'm going to just take all this damage. They, the only way they'd get me to actually block here is if they target me with play with fire. Then they get little skeleton dude back. No blocks. You got me dead if you got it. Land. I need one land. Thank the second sun. We got the combo. All right. <laughs> this is going to get me a lot of flack because there's no new cards. I'm here for it. Um, all right, all right, Voldaren Epicure. What are they doing over there? I have to imagine CGB is doing some kind of sacrifice. All right, all right. I'm going to take one, please and thank you. 
I'm gonna play Tenacious Corn Dog. Great. Great. Please don't have. Oh, that's so bad for me. Okay. Okay. Well met. I don't want any more lands. Please and thank you. All right, let's kill the Sewer King. What do I need here? I need a juice CGB of his cards. Problem is, I think the only way to go about that is drawing Kervik. Uh, sure. I'm holding up Spell Pierce CGB. Be careful. I've got a Spell Pierce online. You don't want to get caught slipping with one of those, do you? Spell Pierce in hand. Yo, we're in so much trouble. I think that's a reanimation. We're going to get reanimated on. We're getting reanimated on. Okay. I need something to hate out the graveyard right now. What are the odds? Right? There's, there's no way. At least we know that if it's throw for the goat, you do not have a reanimation spell. And then I can play Gix's command, get it all back. I really want to be there. I don't want to be here. I want to be there. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Give me my cards. Concerns are they draw a land and play virtue. Okay. Okay. All right. All right, now we play Virtue. First to Virtue. Then I play Trespasser, eat the other Atali. Okay, let's see what happens. Give me what I need. I don't want to cast that. I do want to cast that. Okay. I can reanimate that. We got three beefcakes currently. We're cooking, right? We're cooking. I am not going to give you any creatures to work with. Not if, not if I can help it. Let's just kill this now. <laughs> just in case. I don't know. I don't know what CGB's got over there, but I'm gonna just kill that now. Where's my combo? I want my combo. I might even kill the uh, Atali. Oh, no! Yo, thanks for making it to the end of the video. If you enjoyed that, check out this illicit masquerade deck. It's using all the goifs and trying to capitalize on filling our own graveyard up.